the reason I'm the reason I'm doing this is because firstly I wanna I wanna remember what it's like to live again. I wanna remember what it's like to feel free. And by doing that, I wanna I wanna empower so many other people who are in exactly the same position as me. And probably ten times worse to be able to feel free as well. And to do that, I have to I have to educate myself. I have to be strong. I have to be at the end of it a completely different person to the person I am now. I think what I want to learn more than anything, more than anything, what I want to learn is that I got HIV and it's okay, like, that's what I want to learn more than anything. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a heart attack. Oh. It's the one thing I said I wasn't going to do is cry. You okay? I am. And I feel all weird because, like, Since I've been an escort, I've never really had a, a relationship with another guy. It's business. It's nothing personal. My job's just not the normal job. Like, not the normal nine to five that people are used to. That's the only difference. Oh. And this term escort, you know, it is prostitution. Since I've been an escort, I've never really had a, a relationship with another guy. As part of the session time, some clients, when they arrive, they ask if they can douche. And this is the douche, which is an essential part of my job. Most clients are pretty clean, but sometimes it's like if they've had to travel a long distance, you know. And so I say, look, if you want to have, just do a double check. So, I mean, a lot of them know how to use one, but there's, there's a few, <sighs> thank God for wet wipes. My working name is Sleazy Michael. I've been a full-time male escort for the last 12 years. I didn't start the escort till I was 46. I'm now 58.